They said that I was one of those pretty and charming girls born. I was rich. I had no marriage portion. No expectations. I married off to a little clerk in the Ministry of Education. I was unhappy. I suffered endlessly. I was hungry for every delicacy and luxury. My life was a mess. I'm sick of living in this little house. Mean walls, worn chairs and ugly curtains. No rich girl would want a life like this. No girl would want a life like this. Aha! Chicken broth. What could be better? It's so delicious. I want some more. Matilde, are you fine? Why are you silent? Yes, I'm just tired. You're sure? I'll get it. No, I'll get it. Oh, good afternoon, Miracles. Good afternoon, Mr. Lyson. Would you like to come in? No, thank you. We're just dropping off this invitation for a formal party. Us? Yes, Mr. Lysel. Uh, we'll be expecting you. Have a good afternoon. Here's something for you. And what do you want me to do with this? Why, Derby? I thought you'd be happy. You never go out. And this is a very great occasion. I'm lucky. I'm chosen. That is. And what do you think I'm gonna wear with such an affair? Why? The dress you go to the theater in. It looks very nice to you. <laughs> What's the matter with you? Nothing. Only I don't have a dress to wear. Give the invitation to a friend of yours whose wife will look better than me. <laughs> Wait! Look, Matilde, how much do you need to buy a simple dress? I don't know exactly, but 400 pesos will do. No problem. I'll give you 400 pesos. But make sure you will buy a nice dress, okay? Thank you so much. Oh wait, let's go to sleep. <coughs> Matilde? Good morning! Did you enjoy your breakfast? Of course! Tell me, did you buy a dress? Can I see? Wait, I'll change first. Can I see, Han? You look gorgeous. I guess you're ready for the party. Why? I'm so miserable. I don't even have a jewelry to wear. Wear flowers. It will look good to you, my dear. No, 
There's nothing more humiliating than looking poor in the middle of the party with lots of rich women. How stupid you are. Go out and see Madame Forrester and ask her to lend you some jewels. Right. I never thought of it. I'll go later. I'll change first and wash the dishes. Honey, I'll go to work. I'll be back before 7 p.m. Okay, honey. If I head home, I'm at Madame Forrester's house. Um, Grana, where's your mother? Good day, Marita. Uh, my mom is here. Do you want to come in? Um, can you please call her? Okay, come inside with me. Madame Forrester? Madame Forrester? Madame Forrester? This is Lysel. What made you go here, my dear? Take a sip. Would you like some juice? No, I'm fine. It's been a long time, my dear. Um, I'm just wondering if you could lend me some jewelry. I will use it at the party on Monday. Come to? Sure, my dear. Here. Don't you have anything else? Yes! Look for yourself! I don't know what you would like the best. Can you lend me this? Just this alone. Some wine. Beautiful lady, may I take this bag? Of course. It won't be long. We gotta play a love just right. I know you know the time will come. But maybe for tonight, let's take a
No, it's just that you look beautiful. Stop bullying me, Mr. Larson. Come on, let's go home. What happened? My necklace is missing. What? Impossible. Are you sure you still have it before we arrive at home? Yes, I touched it before we leave the party. But if you lost it in the street, we should have heard it fall. Yes, probably we could. You didn't notice, did you? No. I'll find it. Tell your friend that we lost it, that we will change it. I have the necklace you're looking for. It is worth 40,000 pesos. Don't sell it for three days. I'll be back. Can I borrow money? Sure. Can I borrow money? Can I borrow money? Sure. Thank you for lending me this, and sorry if it took too long. You should have brought it back sooner. I don't know you. You must be making a mistake. I am Matilde. <laughs> oh, my poor Matilde. How you've changed. I have some hard times and sorrows because of you. <laughs> because of me? How is that so? Remember the necklace you lent me? I lost it. How could you? You brought it back. I bought another one for replacement. We have been paying it for 10 years. 
You haven't noticed that? Really? Oh my poor Matilda! But mine was an imitation, which is only 500 pesos.